In this video, we will see how to define material properties in Midas and Gen. We can go to the Define tab and click on Material tool. This is the Material Definition dialog box. Here, we can define steel and concrete material properties. This icon represents steel material property and this icon represents concrete material property. While performing steel or concrete design, the program detects the members from the material property assigned. The material ID is the main identity of the material property. The material ID taken here is 3 because there are two predefined material properties. The material ID is always numeric. The name can be any for our reference like steel. The color of our material property can be changed from here. When we ask the program to show color of members by material property, then these colors will be displayed on the structural members. We can define the material properties by using codes available in this list. Once we select the code, the grade of steel as per the selected code will be enlisted here. For user defined material property, all we need to do is uncheck the code. Below over here, we can provide the material properties for elastic analysis such as modulus of elasticity, Poisson's ratio, thermal coefficient, weight density. For design, we can provide here the tensile strength and yield strength of steel. For dynamic analysis, we can provide here the damping ratio. By default, the value is 5%. However, usually for steel, we take 2%. To finish the definition, there are two options here, OK and Add. When we click on OK, the dialog box will define and close. When we click on Add, the dialog box will define and stay open for the next definition. We can see the defined material properties from the Model Tree menu. Expand property under material. Here we have our material properties defined. We can modify these properties by simply right clicking and clicking on modify. We can also import material properties from previously created Midas Engine model file. For that, simply right click on material and click on import. Select the previously created model file and click on open. The imported material properties can be seen over here. Material is assigned to a section property. This is a section property and in the bracket we see the material assigned to that section property. I will open up the steel structure over here to see what is the material property of a member. All you need to do is select that member. Once we select under the properties tree menu we can see the section property and the material assigned to the section property. If we would like to change the material property assigned to the section property, all we need to do is simply right click on the section property and click on change material strength. 
we can select any other material property and click on the material property has been modified. This is how we can define as well as assign material properties in Midas engine.